And I'm gonna do a sped up montage for some music. Enjoy. <laughs> Holy shit, it's your rival. And he's being scolded by the sage. Yeah. Your rival kind of looks like a girl. Wow, I, have, I shouldn't have that all. Anyway. Yeah, I'm actually going to share this battle with this because it's kind of important. And this guy gives you flash, which isn't really that important, that important in this game because... I don't believe there's any cave that you have to go through with Flash in it. And I'm gonna find this guy. Yeah. Same old stuff. Come on. Alright. This is kinda like, I don't know, a little less than gym battle. It's like, kinda like a gym battle before a gym battle. Cause, in many ways the Sprout Tower is like a gym. Except they just have like bell sprouts and crap. Yeah. This uh PG's going pretty well. It's even better than my starter. Hoot hoot. AKA Hooters. If I get a hoot hoot, nickname it Hooters. Just this is the hell of it. Alright. Come on. Die. Looks like that's a third. Yeah. Pokemon is so fun, but it gets boring. Don't play it too much, it'll, or you'll hate it. Luckily, I don't play it all the time. Played in bursts. That's that's when Pokemon's best played in bursts. Unfortunately, by the time I get halfway through this uh, walkthrough, I'll get so bored and I won't want to play it anymore. If you're talking about more about the game, or just things about it, or funny stuff, or whatever, I don't know. I'm just playing anyway. And... Get flashed. Not that important. Don't teach it to any of your Pokemon. It's pointless. Maybe, maybe you can get an HM slave, but I would not suggest using it in battle. Also, I forgot to mention, Pidgey and Pidgeotto would be really good against the second gym, which has bug type. So, there's just so many reasons to get Pidgey in this game early on. Sprout Tower, you can easily train him in. Uh, fly, you'll be able to do that once you get it. And, uh, it's a pretty good Pokemon, and it's good against the second gym. So there's just so many reasons to get it. Wow, I'm stupid. All right, escape rope. I never really understood the escape rope. Like, where do you put the escape rope down? It's time to reorder the Pokemon. PT will be last because he's the strongest. Bellsprout's gonna 
suck balls anyway. I'll just see him die. So we just got two bird keepers to fight. Not that hard. Have you ever noticed that this thing kind of makes sort of a dollar sign? Random trivia. I don't know, maybe bird keepers and Faulkner, the leader, or pimps. Don't really know about that. Spiro, haven't seen one of those. Level 9. Man, yeah, this Bell this Bell Sprout's gonna die. Bell Sprout's pretty weak, but its of all forms are pretty decent. I mean, Victory Bell's pretty good. Hell, James from uh from Team Rocket used it, so why not? Hope Cyndaquil doesn't suck balls. Cause I, I really don't want Pidgey to be my best Pokemon. Or I mean you kinda want your starter to be your best Pokemon, you know. Just because you've had it since the beginning and having another non legendary sort of takeover is kind of unfun. That rhymes. <laughs> hmm. Hopefully I'll level up after this. Yeah. 111. Oh man. Birdkeeper Abe. Abe's a pretty cool name, actually. Yep, makes a dollar sign. I guess they're pimps. What's with this gym anyway? Is it like are the platforms like levitated from a bottomless pit or something? It's hard to tell. It's another bird bird keeper rod. That has sexual innuendos written all over it. So I'm not going to elaborate on that. Cyndaquil. About two or three hits should kill this thing. Uh, maybe four. Dang. And actually one Cyndaquil to uh, not die because... Just because. Um, alright. It's probably going to be four. Yeah, it sucks. Don't be a critical. Yeah, alright. Because I, I rarely use, like, status healers just because. Unless I'm in a desperate situation, I'm pretty much not going to use them. Because that's just me. Because it's kind of like... It's kind of like living on a respirator, you know? It's your time to go. So it's your time to go, you know? Yeah. I should probably, uh... Let me just use a berry on oh, Cyndaquil. All right, just so I can, you know, finish him up. Critical hit, damn it! Probably should use a potion there. All right, should be two more, and then I'll kill him. Yeah. Hmm. All right, and he's dead. Or fainted, because in, in Pokemon, the Pokemon never die, they faint. Which is weird, because they should have some kind of lifespan. Alright, I'm just going to heal up real quick.